We're gonna see Hinata. He's gonna see Hinata. Oh, Hinata. That face breaks my heart, actually. What's going on, guys? Today, I'm checking out Haikyuu's Season 4, Episode 2, Lost. Hinata did not have the brightest moment in that last episode, and I even felt that secondhand embarrassment. I'm hoping that something happens with this week where Ushi's team's coach can just see something in Hinata because he's really harsh on him, and I think it's just because he sees a lot of himself in Hinata, and he's just expecting a level of failure from him. So we're gonna hop right into it, so let's get to it. <laughs> Oh, one month. I thought they said a week. Like before the tournament. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> oh, is he not willing to? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no, he's okay. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, nice. At least he's not completely alone. Oh, he's just the instinct. Oh, uh, he's not a... だ、すごい。だって yeah, totally getting the vibe, right? No, because Hinata chose to stay too. I am not a Yamete. Kimi no Totot's motion baka, Imani Hazamata Kotajanai. No, Kuni Bolus are not the Kuyashi. やっぱりなめます。すげえ。せいせい、ボール拾い頑張って。歩く前の貴重な5日間、棒に振らないように。イメージを今週のジャンプ返して。Oh, oh, I can also kind of see where the coach is coming from like you don't really want to reward Hinata's behavior by letting him attend the practice match, but I don't know if now they're applying that Ushi being there tomorrow might change something. <笑>いつ <laughs> I wonder what the um I mean I'm sure it's obviously like a cultural thing, but I wonder what made them be in that position at school like that since there are sofas right next to them. Um normally when I see people sitting like that, it's either like maybe when they're in their homes or like maybe more traditional settings. So just seeing that in a school setting was actually quite interesting. Oh you nada, you got through the tough part. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Daichi too. Oh. Yeah, take advantage of like what you can. Oh, 
What's done is done. Now you gotta see it through. He must be feeling so desperate too that he's not actually practicing. Oh. <laughs> Cool guys. <laughs> Tsuki. <laughs> Ugh. Hinata, behave yourself. <laughs> oh, he not uh, that face breaks my heart actually. <laughs> He's over here to just drink water. <laughs> no one's safe from his feedback. Oh, nice. Oh, man, not those. Oh. Because he crashed the party. <laughs> oh. <laughs> mm. I mean, at this point, you're just seeing it through, right? <laughs> Double. <laughs> What you think of my guy? I'm actually liking that they're showing this. Like, despite how great Hinata is, and uh, a top character like he has his own downsides and i think that's like the beauty of his character too right it's not always positive like he makes mistakes and now we're seeing him trying to deal with that and we saw with the first season when he was trying to take the um a spot we saw it in the second season i think again when he like clashed with asahi and we're seeing it again here, you know, where he made an unfortunate decision and now he's like dealing with the consequence. He's so flustered. So many like aspects like pulling him from each side. Oh, he's so self-aware of it. He just can't figure it out, but I love the self-awareness. Cool shot. But it looks like they're not going to give you the answer in this episode. <laughs> So if I were to take a stab at what it is that Hinata's finding, right? Just based off of what everyone is telling him. Take advantage that you're there. Try to see and witness what it is that these other players are doing and try to apply that in whichever way you can. So maybe he can like work on his like receive. I think that's like the the furthest I can think of. I don't I don't know what else he can really do. And just like, you know, obviously just witnessing like just techniques, how he's able to, how he's been already doing. But I think receiving is what I can think of right now. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry if that's not such an impressive conclusion, but that's really like from my little understanding of this sport is what I could come up with. <laughs>
I don't think we got much of anything of Kageyama in this episode, which is okay because once again, I have to remember that we do have a longer season this time, so we have plenty of room to play with. I guess that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below. I love hearing from you guys. Subscribe for more content, and I'll see y'all for the next one.